hey guys welcome to my channel so i'm tired of one really serious issue all right so this is like everyone's life uh, everyone face these kind of issues so for, for example if i'm just surfing the web and i found some link i just copied okay so this was not a link fuck me let's just copy a link and i can paste it i can use it pretty cool but there is some other link okay so most of the time i ended up copying some other link or some other message or anything all right it can be anything and i lost the first thing which i have in my clipboard and it sucks it fucking sucks i can't even tell you how much i hate this okay so i just close the application and then i have to open it again so i'm just going to solve it okay so let's just solve it so the tool which i use is xclip which is like it's an x utility for clipboard so if you are using xor now if you don't know xor well if you are if you don't know xor and you are using linux you are using xor all right so let's just move on okay so this, if you have this program installed basically this is going to manage your clipboard or there are many you know clipboard managing programs which people use but i don't like i just want to stick with xclip all right so one of the most important command which i use is this command okay all right so what is this command so suppose if you just echo the link uh http has uh, you can just pipe it into xlip okay so xlip is going to just put it into the clipboard so hyphen sel means selection and c means clipboard and it's a short form by the way if you want you can just type this okay in, in some of my previous video i was used to type the whole thing but now i realized like this is it so if i press enter okay let's just remove this part for a second so this is just going to echo it and if i just add again so this is not going to print it okay so there is nothing we no output all right so it's in our clipboard now and i can just prove this so as you can see i pasted it and it was in my clipboard which is pretty cool uh, so it is actually very useful okay so for example most people when they make tutorials they hide their key but i don't have to do it so suppose if i have this key i most of the time i'm doing screencasts i can just you know get my key i'm not going to get it it's a secret key all right and just exclip it so this just saves so much um, like trouble all right so let's move with this command so this is just one command by the way and suppose if i just copy some some text here and uh, there is just another command which is uh, okay x slave hyphen o for output and then selection c so this is like just hyphen o for output and just press enter and as you can see whatever i have in my clipboard so suppose if i copy this link so it's going to just print it okay print it this is so cool let's do it again okay so just copy this link and uh, just print it all right so we got like two commands so now let's just solve my problem because it's fucking killing me all right so the it's pretty simple by the way so this is like we are getting the output but as you can see this percentage means that we are not getting any next line so what i can do is i can just echo it all right so this is going to just get rid of the problem now we are getting our next line and i can just you know push it like redirect it into some file like temp uh temp clip.txt now this temp directory it means that uh, every time i restart my computer this directory is going to get empty all right so this is really, really good because i just want to you know have a temporary clipboard record not permanent and just press enter and now there is no output but if i do you know cat temp temp clip okay so press enter and as you can see the output is actually here all right so this is really cool because now i wrote a script in my local bin which is like a temp clip as you can see this script is just shebang line and let's just open it with bin wait okay so uh, just the shebang line and then echo you know what if i really want colors let's just uh, not win okay you guys are like okay so just lol cat it okay so as you can see this is like echo okay this is not like proper color but I, okay you can distinguish like this is echo and this is okay so bullshit aside so we, this script is going to save whatever i have in my clipboard but this is not going to work right i mean uh, it's like a partial thing so suppose if i just copy this link 
I can just run temp clip from my D menu and now this link is saved uh, temporarily because every time I restart my computer the link will be gone from the the file will be gone because it's in temp directory okay so this is cool but the real question is how I'm going to get this link later because obviously like it's like saving is not what I want I want a efficient way of getting the link out again from that particular file and it's actually pretty simple let's just get out temp temp clip dot txt and as you can see right now I only only have two links let's just add some more links so uh, not links just you can add anything actually temp clip and uh, you know just copy this link and temp clip and after that like now i have like four links so what i can do is uh just uh, this is this program d menu okay so i can just get in get the output into d menu and hyphen l for list and then list size is like 10 and as you can see i'm getting like my options here and you can also use fcf many people who realize like they don't use the menu they can always use fcf but again i i use dwm okay so i'm going to use uh d d menu okay so the output is basically whatever i select and as you can see so it's pretty simple now i think my channel is like okay one year telling you the same stuff over and over all right so uh copy this and as you can see i'm getting the output so now what i can do is i can just pipe it into x -Lay okay selection c okay so let's just copy something and it's in my clipboard let's hope all right so as you can see I, when i paste it it was in my clipboard but there is one issue okay so i'm getting a next line and i don't really want it so what i can do is here okay so now here what i can do is there is this command tr hyphen n not n d for deleting and then just next line all right so i'm going to delete the next line with this command trunkinate all right trunk i don't know what this is let's just see translate or delete character all right this is not truncate or something so let's first enter just copy something and paste again so there is no next line which is pretty cool and i also made a another script so it's done so d clip and this script is like um, doing exactly what I showed you. Okay, why I opened Vim again? Let's just lol get. Okay, so look at this. It, it looks pretty. Not really. It's so many Ruby packages. Okay, so now it's the problem is solved. Every time I copy something which is like useful, because most of the time I have the other thing which I want to copy, but I know I already have something important in my clipboard, which is like, it's so frustrating. Like, okay, what can I do now? Let's just open the paste and then, okay, let's copy this. Okay, now those days are gone. Just, just copy something and just temp save it and temp clip it. And after that, you're done. Okay, you don't really have to worry about that thing because most of the time when I copy some, you know, thing, I usually need again and again. Okay, I usually need. I think you get it. So that's it. Ne laissant rien que chaque